Hey everyone, this is Scott from Xexpress, and today we're going to be configuring your testimonials in your WP1 Slider Pro. So to do this, we'll go to our backend, add add a new slider, name the slider testimonial slider. Go to slider type and choose testimonial slide, and we can begin adding testimonial slides here I'm just going to fill in you can fill this information over here we have the name email and so on so I'm just going to copy the name and paste it over here similarly with the email I'm just going to copy this and paste it over here same for the company name I'm just going to copy this so let me inspect and grab this text over here and I'm just going to paste it over here and the company organization just going to copy this so my designation and the company URL the company URL will be set in your company name similarly for the image just going to select this image right here and save and for the ratings I'm just going to give you five stars and give you summary I'm just going to copy this and paste it over here I'm going to enable social icons so here I have different platforms such as Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, Skype and Instagram so you can put your testimonial uh, links over here similarly I'm going to create another slide and I'm going to do the same I'll choose another slide. I'll copy the name, the email, the company name. So I'll have to inspect for this one as well. Just gonna copy this and paste it over here. Over here, then the designation. company URL set an image and the rating the summary and your social icons so Facebook so you can give your clients Facebook page or the Twitter information or the LinkedIn or the Skype or the Instagram uh, information so once we have configured the slides let's look at some of the settings so here you have the single slide or the carousel slide for now I'm going to select single slide uh, select a box shadow I'm going to choose false choose a uh, navigation arrow and here you have different settings for your uh, testimonial you can change colors and give font sizes so I'm just going to copy this soft code go to page and I'm just going to add a new page for the testimonial call it testimonial paste the code let's call this page testimonial slider so after doing this, I'll just update the page and view my front end. And here we have your single testimonial slider using your WP1 slider. You can see the image, the designation, the name, the description, and so on and so forth. So convert this into a carousel slider. We'll just go back to our general settings, sliders style and carousel and update so after we have done this we we'll just refresh and here we have our carousel view so some of the more settings here are like carousel slider you can choose uh, many different settings and this will affect your slider in the front end thank you for watching